All right. I just want to warn you guys, it's getting offensively stupid out there. <laughs> like, offensively stupid. I got a pizza at Papa John's. You, you made me think of this. I wasn't even going to do this one. But 11-11 uh, happened, right? And you got the large pizza for $11, so obviously I'm all over that. Uh, and I go there, and the lady, well, lady, I mean, she was like 15, if a day. And, like, she's like, are you waiting for a pizza? And I'm like, I think I speak for everyone when I say we're all waiting for a pizza. But, I mean, you got to break the ice somehow, so... Eh, not too bad. Like, may I help you? You know, that's the polite one. Anyways, so she goes, name, and I go, Stephen. And she goes, Stefan? No, no, I, I got it right. The first time. That's my name. And she goes, oh, well, I think they spelled it wrong. And I go, no, 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 we ordered online. Yeah, and you got it. <laughs> Nothing happens. You know when like you see a girl, like, okay, digression, you're hitting on a girl at a bar, right? And you're like, I got a chance. There's nothing happening. <laughs> right, I got a chance. There's not, I can make up whatever I want. Nothing happened. And I go, therefore, I spelled it myself. Still nothing. <laughs> Offensively stupid. I don't know what we're teaching these kids. It, I was... Now, see, now I got, I'm way off track. I was in line at Starbucks the other month or something, and there were these two Cubs fans. And oh my god, I hate Cubs fans. Not the classy Cubs fans, okay? Not the guys that drink beer at Wrigley Field and hit on you on the red line. Not the classy ones. It was these two guys, and the reason I noticed it is because they were talking about Harry Potter, which I thought was a little odd. And I forget what they were talking about, but I tuned in, and then he goes, Oh, what do you want to drink? And he goes, no, man, that has too much espresso. And the other guy goes, dude, it's fucking espresso. Like, learn English. And I had to interject. I was like, do you mean Italian? Because that's Italian. We use it, but it's still Italian. It is ridiculous. I feel smart because I, uh, <laughs> I double majored at University of Memphis, actually. I had a, a double major in theater and philosophy, which mainly because, you know, I never really wanted to be burdened with money. <laughs> and I got to tell y'all, it's working great. It's really working great. I mean, the other, I never have to carry too many groceries. Never have to. I always know what to wear. And uh, I never have awkward moments with homeless people. Hey, man, can you spare a dollar? Nope. <laughs> There's that. Somehow you time traveled from the 50s, apparently. <laughs> but uh, the, the only reason I did the double major, it, it just sort of adds something to your resume. And philosophy at University of Memphis, guys, it's two courses. It's real <laughs> easy. The first one is Jesus did it. And the second one is evolution is a lie. And you don't really do anything, you just kind of show up and repeat it over and over and over and over until it becomes true. And then they give you a certificate, congratulations, you're a Republican, go about your merry way. <laughs> and it's funny, I remember, now I'm thinking about it, I remember for the final, the professor actually brought in a heretic, and we got to throw our books at him. It was great, and uh, no, I'm, I'm sorry, that's, that's pretty offensive. It. We threw our books at it. Uh, the theater, theater actually at University of Memphis was really rough, um, mainly because they have a football team on site. And I don't know if you've ever talked to a football player, but they usually can't get past a couple thoughts. They'll talk to you for a little bit, but you kind of lose them. And like, I remember I was talking to one of them, and, and he goes, he's like, oh, yeah, bro, like, what's your major? And I go, well, I, I major in theater. And he goes, what, are you gay? And I'm like, no, like, I'm not, I'm not gay. Like, I don't understand what that. He goes, oh, so you're gay. <laughs> no, 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 I'm, I'm, I'm not gay. I'm, yeah, 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 you're gay. Theater people are gay. I'm like, no, okay, I, I know what you're driving at. <laughs> I know what you're driving at, but, but no, we're not. He goes, you are gay. Like, he said, he, like, raised his voice. 
And it was just enough that like other people paid attention. And like now I'm on the defensive, right? And I gotta like insult this guy without letting him know, um, which is wasn't that hard. But I just go, whoa, dude, like calm down. I don't match outfits with all my friends and chase each other around a field while other men cheer. <laughs> all right, guys, my name is Stephen Kerrigan. Thank you for your time. I do appreciate it.